Hey everybody, this is Greg McDaniel with the McDaniel Callahan Real Estate Team and this is Fun in the Bay November Edition. Our first event is an amazing event. It's going to take place on November 10th. It's going to take place at AT&T Stadium. Uh, what this is, this is an awesome event. When I first learned about it, I was blown away. But this is the Beer and Bacon event. Now, this is going to be a lot of fun. Uh, tickets start at around noon, and they go all the way into the evening for evening edition at 7 p.m. But there's going to be over 100 beers. There's going to be more than 30 dishes with bacon-infused recipes, all from local chefs. So if you guys like beer and you like bacon, Get your rear ends over to at and Park on November 10th and have some fun. Our second amazing event that's going to be taking place on November 15th and 16th, it's a two-day event, uh, it is the Chocolate and Art Show. It's going to be taking place uh, at the Soma Cultural Center. It's going to be located at 934 Brandon Street in San Francisco. If you guys like chocolate and you guys like art, this is your place to be because both on the 15th and the 16th, uh, it's going to be going from 8 p.m. till 2 a.m., so very much a f an adult-friendly event. So go on down, take a look, have some chocolate, and enjoy some art. All right, now our third event is probably one of my absolute favorites every single year. This is the 61st annual San Francisco Chronicle Auto Show. Now, guys, this is going to be going from November uh, 21st through the 25th at the Moscone Center. And if you have not been to this event, you've got to go check it out. There's going to be everything from exotics to concept to your daily driver and much more much more when it comes to seeing new cool cars so if you're a car enthusiast get your rear end over there and enjoy some cool automobiles all right our next event is a really fun family event this is the san rafael parade of lights in winter wonderland it's going to be held on november 23rd uh, the events start around 4 30 and progress throughout the day uh, there's going to be a ton of things to do this is actually the 39th year that put this on in san rafael i mean you're going to have a a, a uh a holiday marketplace, you're going to have arts and crafts, you're going to have live entertainment, you're going to have children's activities, you're going to have snow sledding, and not to save this for the last, but you're going to have one of the largest holiday parades in the entire Bay Area. If you guys are looking to get out and have some fun with the kids, head on up to San Rafael for the 39th annual Parade of Lights and have a great family outing. So for our last event is an absolute staple here in the Bay Area. This is the Union Square tree lighting uh, that Macy's has been putting on for 29 years. This is going to be happening on uh, November 23rd. So if our last event, if you don't want to go up to San Rafael, but you want to be more in the city, come on into Union Square. It's going to be Black Friday, so you're going to have a great day to go in there, do some shopping, get in the spirit of Christmas right after Thanksgiving. Now, the event of the Christmas tree lighting is going to start at around 5.30. And then they're going to actually light the tree somewhere around 6.50. So you have a little bit of time to get some shopping, get some hot cocoa, and get out there and watch the tree being lit. Now, guys, there are a lot of fun activities to be done, not only in the Bay Area, but around the country. If we can help you with any real estate, either buying or selling, either here in the Bay, or you need a referral for somewhere else in the country, give us a call. Again, my name is Greg McDaniel. I'm with the McDaniel Callahan Real Estate Team, and I look forward to seeing you on the next video.